To start off, please select Add to add a part. Then select the desired file. Here, you can choose the part type. Select Prepare to prepare the part. On this page, it will relist the part types. Please use this time to double check. Next, you can set the milling direction. Please select Cavity and move on to the margin lines. To add a margin line, all you have to do is click where the margin line will be. The software will detect and add the margin line for you. Please select Next so we can load a blank. In this case, we will be using a new blank. Underneath, you can choose not only the type of disk, but the sizing. If you do not like the preset sizes on the right side, you can see the scaling factor where you can customize and change the size. Underneath, you can change the blank name. In this case, we will be naming the blank Zirconia 12mm. Then select Create. Please select the Move Part option. This will allow you to move or twist the crown. Please ensure that the crown does not touch the red line circling the fixture. Next, you will want to set connectors. Please select the connector options and click on the crown, where it will automatically set your connectors. To manually add connectors, please select the manual option. Then, rotate the fixture, and add connectors wherever desired. Even though you've already placed a connector, you can manually move it or delete it. Now, you are ready to calculate your toolpath. Thank you.